might be destroyed soon. Oh no. What's up guys, my name's Dave Waffle and welcome to IO. <laughs> So let me ask you this, guys. Are you guys afraid of the fact that we might be killed by a giant asteroid and we would never even know about it? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. So recently, scientists are on a mission to bring more awareness to the entire Earth about the possibility of near-Earth collisions and basically what is actually happening up there. So an institution by the name of B612, crazy name, but they are a private foundation. They aim to protect the Earth from incoming objects. No, we're not talking aliens, guys. Let's leave that for another video. Now, many of you might be out there saying, oh, well, this sort of thing would never happen. Why? Because it's so bloody rare. But as a matter of fact, the B612 Foundation, I swear to God, B612 Foundation sounds like a vitamin I'm taking. They believe that asteroid impacts are three to ten times more common than we previously thought. They've actually stated that since the year 2000, 26 big asteroids have hit the Earth. We're talking big ones, ones that have an explosion that is as big as the atomic bomb in Hiroshima or Nagasaki. So where are they getting their evidence from? I mean, it's not like we see asteroids in the newspapers all the time. They get it from the Nuclear Test Ban Treaty Organization. Their job is to actually monitor nuclear explosions throughout the world. They do this by listening for infrasounds 24 hours, seven days a week all around the world. And they found that the 26 explosions have not been because of nuclear ordnance. So they obviously come from asteroids. Fortunately for us, most of them hit in the ocean, but they're basically saying it's just a matter of time until one hits a city. Kind of like that one in Russia that happened a couple of years back. They were, you know, close. And here it is. This is Cray Hey Zay. The fact that you could be sitting there right now watching a YouTube video and out of nowhere, you're dead. Doesn't that scare you just a bit? Not me, but I'm a spiritual person. Mm. A lot of this is actually blind luck, considering some of them they can't even see. Why? Because it's dark outside. Fortunately, big things like the moon actually saves our butts all the time, and of course, big planets such as Jupiter and Saturn, and of course the sun, they take all that sort of stuff. So who knows? We might actually get hit. You know, when I think about this, we need to get the heck off this rock and build another world. We can have two of them. So in case one goes down, we have a backup. Let's go to Mars. So if you could live on any planet in our solar system, what planet would it be? And yes, you would be alive, you know. I don't know how you would be, but you would be alive. Thanks for watching. My name is Dave Waffle, AKA The Waffle. And of course, as I always say, keep it real, keep it classy, keep it on the flip side, out there in the cosmic universe. Mr. Well, Scott, beat me up. Oh yeah, guys, by the way, especially for you ladies out there, we've got IO shirts. Head on over to our store. And if you're gonna buy a shirt and you're a girl, you're actually gonna get 15% off if you type in the promo code, hey mama. That's all. Head on over there now. Cool.